Did you know that 99% of all Christians believe they have the responsibility to share the gospel with the lost? Yet 80% of believers do not consistently witness for Christ. That means that only 19% of Bible-believing Christians are doing what they believe God wants them to do when it comes to evangelizing the lost. So why should you, as a Christian, share your faith? Here are 10 reasons. You should share your faith because Jesus commands you to. In Mark 16, 15, Jesus said, Go into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. That means you should share the gospel with your family, friends, co-workers, classmates, neighbors, and even the clerk at the store. God doesn't want people to perish. Peter wrote that the Lord is not willing that any should perish, but that all should come to repentance. Do you want those people whom Jesus died for to perish forever? No, and neither does the Lord. So share the good news with the lost. People don't get saved without hearing the gospel. The Apostle Paul wrote to the Romans saying, How then shall they call on him in whom they have not believed? And how shall they believe in him of whom they have not heard? And how shall they hear without a preacher? That's where you come in. You should evangelize because it demonstrates God's love for the lost. Do you realize that God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whoever believes in Him should not perish but have everlasting life? God loved you so much that He sent His Son to die for you. Then He sent someone to share that good news with you. Now He wants you to share His love with others. The unbelieving world is condemned apart from faith in Christ. John 3.18 says, He who believes in Him is not condemned. But he who does not believe is condemned already, because he has not believed in the name of the only begotten Son of God. You have the power to share a message that will pardon someone from the condemnation of an eternal death sentence. So get out there and give them that message. Sharing your faith with non-believers is a wise thing to do. Proverbs 11.30 says, The fruit of the righteous is a tree of life, and he who wins souls is wise. Wisdom is the application of knowledge, so take what you know about the gospel and share it with others, demonstrating that you are wise in the kingdom of God. Sharing your faith helps you grow spiritually and bear more fruit. Jesus said in John 15 too, Every branch in me that does not bear fruit he takes away, and every branch that bears fruit he prunes, that it may bear more fruit. Initially, it may be uncomfortable for you to share your faith, but with a little practice, you'll find yourself bearing much fruit for the Lord. You should actively be involved in evangelism because the harvest truly is great, but the laborers are few. The reality is that 95% of born-again believers have never won a soul to Christ. Imagine how much of an impact we could have for the kingdom of God if every believer were winning souls for the Lord. You were sent as Christ's ambassador to this world. 2 Corinthians 5.20 says, Now then we are ambassadors for Christ, as though God were pleading through us. We implore you on Christ's behalf, be reconciled to God. God has chosen you as one of His ambassadors to deliver a message of peace. Seeing the lost come to faith in Christ brings joy to God and to us as Christians. In Luke 15, 7, Jesus says, I say to you that likewise there will be more joy in heaven over one sinner who repents than over 99 just persons who need no repentance. One of the greatest joys in life is leading someone to faith in Jesus Christ. So bring joy to the heart of God and to yourself by sharing the gospel.